How do I see my last year's production? We get this question quite often in January of the year as people look back to see how much activity they had in their business last year. It's really easy. I'm going to show you how to do it in today's video. So we'd like for you to go to our website, mymetrotex.com. You're going to go to MLS login. You'll log in. That's going to take you to the Netris portal. And on the Netris portal, you're going to go to Matrix, our main MLS system. And once you're in Matrix, you have the main menu across the top. One of the things to the right is Market Reports. When you click on Market Reports, I've got several other things I can do here that you can't do. But you should see all the way down to Agent production and inventory and for this purpose this is the report that you want agent production and inventory when you click there it says this report will run for the current user meaning you're logged into matrix it's going to show your current um, production and inventory in matrix so if you want to see last year you're going to go want to go back to january 1st of 2022, not 2023. And then you're going to want to go to December 31st of 2022. Okay, so that's the date range you would put in. And then you would hit the Generate Report button. Now, I didn't have any production as a realtor last year, so I'm going to have to go back further to find some of my production and I'm going to hit generate report. When I do that, that's going to generate this report. It's going to look a lot like yours. And here at the top, you're going to see the production section. It's going to ha uh, have lots of numbers here for you. How many listings did you sell? How many were sold in house? How many were sold with cooperating brokers? I mean, you worked with a, uh, an agent from another brokerage, all of those different things. And then your co-op sold down here and listing sold. That's going to be the ones that you worked with the buyers. And then if you come down below, it's going to show the raw listings here. So how many listings did you have that you sold? How many of them were sold in-house? How many were co-ops sold, meaning you sold in another broker's uh, listing, and all of that. So this is the report that you're looking for to see your past production and inventory. Lots of useful data here for you. Okay, so that's the report you're going to want to run for your last year's production. Now, there are some other reports. If we go to uh, market reports, there is the agent market share right here. When you click on that, it also does a date range. So we'll just do 2022 to um, January of this year. And then you can do this report by different rankings, total volume, list side, sales side, total transactions, any of these reports that you run and run. And then you can also tell it how many rows you want to think, uh, to see. You may not be in the top 25, top 100 in a particular area, and you think you're down a little bit lower. You can put in more lines in the report. You can also put in your uh, MLS number or name here, and it will just show your production turn that time frame in whatever area you select. So I'm going to get rid of Louisiana, just do Texas. Let's just do residential. We could pick a zip code, a county, a city. We could do a price range if we wanted to. I used to live in 75028. So I'm just going to look at that. I'm not going to put in any other criteria except for residential in 75028. And I'm going to generate the report. And it's going to generate another report for me that shows who did the most volume in that area. And it stack ranks them by their name and the number of sales or volume that they had in that area. So another useful report, not everybody's a top ranking agent, I understand that. So you may not be uh, real high in 
your area, but it is an interesting report to look at. Okay, then we have the same thing for office reports. Let me get back to the market reports here. So we have the same thing for our uh, market off office share. You can see your uh, share by listed, by the office listed. Probably the most valuable one for you for looking back at last year is that agent production and inventory. I hope that helps. Give us a call at the MLS department if we can ever help you.